going on? I don't want to get my feet wet. What's up, guys? Eat my new gun. Sentry Arms AK-47 full mag pull furniture. I guess it's basically an AKM. Uh, might actually do a build series on this gun. Um, I want to build it up. Yeah, anyway, if you guys want to see build series on this, leave a comment below. Anyway, guys, what I'm going to be doing today is I'm going to be going fishing, I think, if the wind dies down a little bit. I'm taking my, uh, my bass tracker out for the first time this year. I finally got it registered, so now I can take that out, um, make sure everything's running good for upcoming tournaments this summer, and do out, get out and do some bass fishing. Um, but before I do that, I'm going to check some fluids on my truck. I'm going to check the oil uh, and check the transmission fluid and all that good stuff real quick, and then hopefully I can get out on the water. This thing's low on oil again. Okay, so that actually ended up being um, a little over half of a quart low, and I just topped it off like two weeks ago. So maybe you guys can expect a motor swap in the near future. One thing that kind of sucks about driving a lifted truck is that you can't like, when you're looking back behind me, like you can't even see the stinking boat that I'm backing up to because my tailgate. So like that part kind of sucks. Same with like backing in a boat. Once it's like going down the boat ramp, I I can't see nothing. Watch it, yeah. Look who yeah, decided to show up. Hey, what's up? Chevy Silver Gato. Am I right? Oh uh, yeah. yeah. You're fantastically right. Where did I put my hat? What? I'm trying to find my hat. Oh, you want a hat? I'm for Dude, I got you a hat. Check what I just got in the mail. Do not open with a knife. Yeah, I ordered a few hats. There's a few Bass Pro hats. Had gift cards, so. Hey. Well, me and Trav got the. We got new hats. Matching Bass Pro hats, so we better catch some bass now tonight. We got. We have to. There's no doubt about it. We got it. Oh. This is the boat checklist. Um. Trolling motor, check. Um, boat, check. Um, yeah, mm, that sucks. Yeah. Anyway, I got the GoPro and the drone, so we're gonna go hook into some some bass, hopefully. That's it. Thank you. All right, I'm Pick taking the camera. Well, Big Travis taking the camera. All right. Let me find my keys here. Hey, dude, remember this nut cr nutty bar? Nut crunch bar? Yeah, you didn't eat it? I ate the other one, but then I, I didn't eat this one. I like peanut butter, I just didn't eat it. But, okay, here. sick, dude. Thanks. I was actually gonna bring a couple, but I left them on the counter and I left. Oh! But, yeah. Well, that was. Way to forget. Yeah, you're welcome. Actually, the deepest lake in Minnesota. Yep. Besides Superior, but this is the deepest like lake that's only in Minnesota. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Natural too. All the yeah. mines and. Yep. But there's no mines here. This is completely natural. Well, an iron range, but I mean, yeah. Oh, there's one guy. Oh. Like right well, off. If they were out there in that boat. We'll be fine. Oh yeah, like right off the dock, right there, where that the end of the dock, like 10 feet past there. It's like, what is it called? Like, oh, uh, like 40 feet. Well, I mean, like. Off the dock, 
If you well, you can dive like oh, slowly straight like 200, off the dock. I guess it'd be like two something. Two hundred and I think it's like two seventy, two sixty at the deepest. Okay. A tiny little lake. Yeah. You guys have any luck? No, a couple good strikes. I just gotta be redone anyways. Yeah. Hey, can I? Um, what? Oh. What? What? I have my keys in my pocket. I don't know if I want to carry them. You can just put them in my truck. Sacrifice my body for the camera. Travis <laughs> got so well for the boat too. For mostly. the boat too, yeah, I guess. Yeah. But, hey, the major L there. Happens to all of us, you know. I took the L for you guys, so yeah, you're welcome. Thanks, Travis. You're welcome. Make like some dope B-roll. All right, I'm taking the video now. Hey guys, so taking another L, I'm gonna clarify on that. The end of the dock was not 30, 40 feet. It was definitely just knee, knee deep. Um, but it's like, if you jump off it, it's 40 feet. Yeah, for, for some reason, it's a little little shallower, but that, that actually kind of saved me. I'm gonna slap some bass and... Jabs with the first fish, snagged a northern with a jig. Isn't that I, I exciting? Get off. If you guys don't aren't from Minnesota or you just don't fish, northerns are just kind of like a nuisance fish to catch, unless it's a big one. No, I don't need one. This is just a little guy. It's a rock bass. Are you kidding me? Okay, this is actually a pretty big rock bass. Dude, I've never had a rock bass. It's oh, okay. Maybe I have. Rock bass are probably out spawning too. Nope. Oh, something has it and it's swimming with me. The Colin got the yeah. first bass. Flipped it right up in that piece of wood up there. Right there. They're up super shallow up here on beds, I think. Yeah, we're sitting up on some flats here. Bed fishing. Well, first one. Is it a northern? Or is it a bass? Is it? Is it a nice one? Yeah, it's pretty nice, yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> I don't have a net off to. Yeah, ever. Hey, oh, yeah. this bow flipper with the eight pound test? It's any bigger, don't do that. It's ten pound test, bud. <laughs> oh, ten pound. Dude, Ooh. that thing's got a nice belly on her. Yeah, look at that. Nice. That's Are you nice. just jigging it up and down like I said? Yeah. 
It's like you told me, yeah, just whack. Yeah, it's the first time Travis ever throwing a bass jig. I let him tie on one of mine, and I'm I'm a, I'm a jig and twister tail kind of guy. So yeah, that's all. Tra all Travis ever fishes the jig and twister tail, but I that's because my family is all walleye fishermen. So yeah. So I saw some a bass jig, and he hooked into one first cast. Awesome, dude. The ones that catching them big probably were, but that's a small, not as deep of a lake, so the water gets warmer quicker. Mm-hmm. This one's playing good. Oh, oh. I think you got the biggest one so far. <laughs> I didn't realize it was this big. Heck yeah. Yep, number Talk three. right there. Nice. Look at the belly, dude. These things are feed eating good. Yes. Dang, look at that. Thing's thick. <laughs> Just eating it, dude. What a oh. tank. I don't know. Holy crap. You know, don't, 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 don't flip it. That's gonna break. Just bring it over here. Thanks, bud. Yeah. Oh, Damn. yeah. <laughs> just gonna... Here, take slap it? Just gonna slap some bass. Oh, yeah. Woo! Yeah, if that would have been bad to try boat flipping that. <laughs> yeah. It wasn't hooked very, but very uh -uh. good. That's sick. Sweet. Yep. It's a little dude. Little guy. Is that one of those little ones you're seeing swimming up there? Yeah, I think so. Decent. We're watching them swim. Yeah. We're thinking they're getting kind of they're stage starting to stage for their spawning. The males are starting to go up shallow. Um, we see seen a couple of fish that might have been on beds early, but the females are still seem like they're out a little bit deeper. <laughs> Decent little fish. Nothing like a couple tanks we're catching though. No. Whoops. <laughs> Oops. Hey. <laughs>